why not boom right yeah yeah okay so it works good job developers good job <laughs>
So four, six, and now I need APC and IC housing. So where can I, okay. So I do have one hydroponic station. I'm going to place it in the greenhouse. So it is going to be just like this. And I need two more, and of course, a lot of shoots. So let's place the shoots. I have only 10 of them. So corner, window frame, or oh, window shoot, corner and window frame, or oh, window shoot again, just like that. Now a corner, right? and a shoot bin yes so that's inlet outlet this is the shoot bin perfect and now i need the cables for it so one corner just like that another corner and it has been connected or maybe i can do it here as well so corner corner just like that corner here corner over there so this one so the cables are ready so this is for co2 and on the other side there is a pipe or the opening for the pipe for the water so this is the second hydropo automated hydroponics i'm going to place it somewhere here again and i need one more and I'm still thinking if this is going to be the greenhouse only with six machines or well I mean 12 machines or I can make it like a vertical greenhouse but I'm not sure if I can place the automated hydroponics on, on a grating so maybe I should write if it works so this is the third machine automated hydroponics uh, so do I have any gratings? No, I don't. So let's print grating. And I think I'm going to... <laughs> okay, I can print only one. So let's print few more. So I have one, so I will I will print nine more. And I need to change the nuclear battery in that APC because it is almost discharge so let's change it and i will charge this nuclear battery in this battery charger so that's it i'm going to take the gratings and then i will do some kind of a testing so i have 10 11 gratings that is more than i need and i know this platform is uh, crazy mess but i don't care <laughs> this is just a let's say a prototype so let's try to place the grating here and grating over there so can i place the automated hydroponics on the grating or not like i think i can't but i need to try it because maybe i can maybe and if i would or if it would be possible that would be great so i will leave the gratings here beside the computer so this is the third automated hydroponics I'm going to place it and then I will need some APCs. So this is the last automated hydroponics. And of course I need more shoots because I think I don't have enough. So corner here somewhere, right? Just like that. And I'm out of shoots. But the greenhouse or the future greenhouse looks good already. So I could see the shoots from outside. 
but I need to find a way how can I connect the water inside these machines and of course I need to connect the data port so let's jump here and I think I'm going to print the heavy cables so heavy cables okay, so I do have the resources for many heavy cables so let's toss this junk under the stairs so I'm printing the cables and I think I'm going to print more shoots so this is the grating and where the hell is the shoot oh. <laughs> shoot so let's print as much as I can that would be like 13 pieces or 13 units so this is the end of the greenhouse so I will need cables and APCs so far oh <laughs> that looks so funny from a distance like the the shoots flying around so I will collect the shoots and I will place them in the greenhouse or not in the greenhouse around the hydroponics stations just like this just like that corner over here one corner another corner then window shoot another window shoot here and another corner just like that and the shoots has been connected I guess so this is five more and let's extend this output from this greenhouse maybe just like this this should be fine so i do have the automated hydroponics so six of them but now i need to get the heavy cables and i need to connect the data ports and some other other stuff as well so how many cables do i have here 34 so i will wait for one more just like that and let's try to connect the data ports hmm, i'm just thinking how to do it i can do it probably just like this so t section t section t section another t section one more t section and then i will connect them together like I, I could uh, connect it a little bit different but who cares if it is connected and if it works nobody cares just like that and a few more cables and it is going to be connected so these are the data ports from the automated hydroponics boom connected now I think I should rename the hydroponic stations. So let's do it with the labeler. So this is going to be automated hydroponics one, but I will use HA1. So it is going to be automated hydroponics one. This is going to be number two. This is going to be number three. This is four. This is five. And one more and everything is going to be all right. All right, all right. So the automated hydroponics station has been renamed. That's perfect. So now I will need at least two APCs and at least two IC housings so let's find the power controller so I will print two of them what do I need iron okay so iron is fine so two APCs so let's go here and I need to place it somewhere on top or on the on the bottom hmm 
What is better? What is better? Top or bottom? Top or bottom? Yeah, let's place it on the top. So this is going to be the ABC for the other side. So let's open it with a crowbar or not. I'm not going to open it. And let's try. So the IC housing is going to be here. So then I will need probably T section here, maybe. Or just this guy. And this guy. So this guy and T section here. And let's do another T section. Straight cable and another straight cable. So now it it is going to be or it is connected already but next thing what i need is uh, the ic housing so integrated no ic housing no i never know how to find it so let's find it manually so that's ic chip and ic housing should be somewhere here so what do I need? Can I print two of them? Yes, I can. So, IC housing. Perfect. So let's take a look. So, I will need the atmosphere for the hydroponics machines. And then I will need the water for it. But I don't have any water yet for the hydroponic stations. Now, now I'm just thinking maybe I can do like a six gas storages with water for all the machines like uh, not connected together like six separ separate gas storages or I can connect everything together and I can have the water supply somewhere somewhere else Okay, I see how things just in case, just in time. <laughs> they're they're very just in time. So this is the first I see how thing and this is going to be the next I see how thing. So I'm going to rotate it just like that. Do I have the cables? Yes, I do. Perfect. So this guy, this section corners right just like this and that then a t-section and it goes down just like that and your corners you straight cables and it should be all right but i don't have any cable left so now i need to find a way how i can connect the apc over there so let's print another heavy cables, like more heavy cables. So let's try to find heavy cables. Of course, I would be so happy if I could use this stupid search button on this fabricator. So what do I need? I need gold. Okay, so let's make, let's find the gold and let's print a lot of heavy cables. So the, the, the gold should be somewhere here, perfect. Oh, well, 100G. That's not bad, right? 100G of gold just on the floor of my base or of my platform. So I do have... I do have the APCs. And now I need to find a way how can I get the power over there. Maybe I could steal the power here, through this corner and over there. It would be probably the, the shortest way, I guess. Yeah, because why not, right? So I need one more APC or not? Do I want APC? No. Okay, I, I need more copper in the electronic sprinter. So let's find... Oh, 100G of copper. I did some smelting without recording because 
it takes some time and it is not very how to say it entertaining i guess oh come on i did fall from the platform again so well, let me think if i want to make it funny then i will install an elevator in this corner right so elevator will take would take me to the first floor to the greenhouse of course i do have the jetpack but it would look good right hmm now i'm thinking how the hell am i going to connect these apcs because i need some kind of a door inside which go which goes inside the greenhouse so how the hell am i going to do it now let's print door and let's find out and do i want a composite door or a normal normal door so kit door and of course i don't have any iron in the machine so let's solve it so iron boom and we are printing so i will need one or maybe two doors i think i will try one and then I will decide if I want one more because how to say it during the day the door in the greenhouse can be open like the temperature when the temperature is over 15 degrees the plants inside this machine will be fine but when the temperature is under 15 then it is not very good so let's fly a little bit can I place it here? Yes, I can. Hmm. Where do I want to have the power for the door? Glass door or composite door? Probably glass door, right? Oh, shoot. <laughs> I completely forget that I need to build it. Do I need probably the plastic sheets? I guess do I have any plastic sheets here? Nope, I don't think so. And what about... I think I need to make a, some kind of a locker somewhere. Because now I'm running around like a hungry monkey. <laughs> so okay, I do have some cables, at least something, right? so let's find the plastic sheets or i think i'm i'm not going to try to find it i'm going to print some plastic sheets boom maybe just few and i think i will need glass do i have glass yes i do that's perfect so let's take the glass with me and what about iron sheets Oh shoot 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 no no <laughs> why the hell am I printing stupid doors come on I was thinking that I'm printing the plastic sheets yeah so okay this <laughs> this garbage pile is going to be sold to the trader I hope so plastic sheets and i was thinking like what the hell why the plastic sheets are pl printing so slow yes of course because it was door not the plastic sheets okay i do have everything so let's try to build the door so i think i can use the jetpack i don't need to walk around around so how the hell to make the door plastic sheets now I guess I will need the glass let's try the glass no oh construct no 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 yeah oh it's it's finished already oh perfect so the doors are easy to craft or easy to make 
So I will leave the plastic sheets here with the glass. Oh, I can make it. A <laughs> I can make a domino, right? Yeah, let's try the domino. Do I have something similar? Okay, iron sheets. Let's use frames. And that should be fine for the domino effect. Okay, <laughs> I need to break. So just like that. Or maybe just like this. One more and let's try the domino. <laughs> I know it's stupid, but <laughs> why not? Boom, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so it works. Good job, developers. Good job. <laughs> So, I think I do have six hydroponic stations in the greenhouse. The greenhouse is not powered yet. So let's try to make the connection. Hmm, how the hell I'm going to do it? What if I would have the, the electric connection inside the greenhouse? let's connect mm, of course yeah I can't connect the IPC here hmm I don't like it already so how the hell can I do it I think I will leave it as it is guys and I think I will see you in the next one Thank you very much for watching, bye bye.